What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm here with Andy Young and Marika. We're gonna get to know Andy a little bit better because he got called up to the Diamondback, so. Young drives one the other way, and it's in the bullpen for a grand slam! Andrew Young! Oh, that was so dirty! <laughs> Um, so I was drafted in 2016 by St. Louis. So today's actually a pretty cool day because we're playing the Cardinals and a bunch of the dudes I came up with are on the team and I haven't seen them in a long time. So it'll be fun to play against them, but I started at the bottom. I started in rookie ball, debuted in 20, so it was, it was good. Is there anyone like on your team that it's like you guys just have like a connection? You guys are like, like your best, friend best friends. Yeah, I have, I have a lot of, like I came up with some of these guys so like Haven and, and like Timmy Lowe. And, a base hit for Loco. And those guys are probably my best friends on the yeah. team just because we kind of played together in the minor league. So we kind of went through the bushes together and now we're here. So it's like, That's crazy. yeah. yeah. It's like a surreal feeling. Yeah, too. it's crazy because yeah. you're in Jackson, Tennessee and now you're in the big <laughs> leagues and you're just like, well, yeah. I guess we're here. Let's see what we can do. You know? All right, so we know the baseball, Andy, but we don't really know like the real you. So okay. um, we kind of want to get to know. We have a couple questions lined up. Um, but the first one is like, what do you like to do for fun? Like, what's your escape from everything? Um, so growing up in North Dakota, like my grandpa was on a cattle farm. We did a lot of hunting. Okay. So I like to do that, just disappearing into the woods. It's more like there's nothing better than after a season going from city to city for six months to disappear in the, in the woods, you know, and yeah. just get away from everybody and everything. Yeah. So I really like doing that. And then, I mean, we work out together at Push and then I'd say once I mean, the end of October hits, it's just that. And hanging out with those kind of people is a fun escape, too, because it's not the same yeah. as playing a game. So that's kind of just what I've been doing and enjoying it. And then there's obviously friends and stuff like that. But yeah. that's kind of cool. what I do. What's your guilty pleasure? Um, sometimes, if I have a bad game, I go to McDonald's. It makes me happier. <laughs> <laughs> so. That's what I used to do, too. I get a McFlurry. So yeah, I mean, yeah. get like a disgusting greasy burger and some ice cream. It's yeah. kind of my go-to. the ice cream machine is working. Yeah. Which it's it always And then it's just like, I double, just like struck out three times, go to McDonald's, like, I hope this McFlurry makes me happy. And it's like, our ice cream machine's Temporary broken. Happiness. It's like, all right, I'm, I'm just going to go to bed. Our veteran guys are awesome. Um, but we are young, so we make some younger mistakes. And I think 19 out of our 26 active players are zero to two guys, which is kind of crazy. But it's good because there's a lot of opportunity for players. And it's also like a rotating door. So like people are coming from the big leagues to triple A, back and forth, and it's just it's a lot of chaos, but it's fun, you know, it's like yeah. your your group that you came up with. So that's a blast to do that in the big leagues. The same thing you were doing in, in double A. So that was I mean, it's a blast. But obviously when you're playing the Dodgers and the Potters and some of these better teams that have more veterans, it can be it can have its own challenges. So since we're kind of doing a tour, like what's the one place we should go in the stadium? Everyone talks about this giant like churro hot dog thing. I've heard it brought up multiple times, so I think you have to try one of those. And I think it's like right. really big. Thanks so much for like joining with us today. Yeah, we know, we know you, you have to get, get going. Bring me a churro dog. Thank yeah. you guys. Later. Yeah, I'll see you guys. What's up guys? I'm here with Marika. We're at Chase Field. We're doing a little stadium tour here. We're gonna try some food, some desserts. Come with us. <laughs> I feel like if you don't get cheese with your pretzel, who are you? You see that thing? Oh no, the press is broken. <laughs> Wait, you think I can catch a popcorn in my mouth while the escalator goes? Three. No, oh, in the oh, turn. I feel bad because you're making a mess. We'll clean, we'll clean. Three, go. We got the salted pretzel with the cheese dippings. With the chicken strips. We got the classic hot dog because you can't go to a game without a hot dog. Popcorn and a hat. It's great. I need a new. Uh, this. Oh god. Oh god. Should not see Cheers. <laughs> this is like a pretzel. Hey, best fans. So one of the first things. Cheers. <laughs> Hopefully we don't get food poisoning. <laughs> Like no, no, it's buns. easy money right there. Uh, easy money. Cheap <laughs> plug, easy, easy money. money. I don't know. Say hi to Taiki, everyone. Oh, oh, we we catch it. Catch it. Wait, why do we? Oh, no. Why do we? Oh, God. Oh. I got it. We got the ball. All 
All right, what's the vibe here? This is the vibe. If I were to buy something in the store, this would be it. Maybe if Andy hosted a Christmas party. Best D-back of all time? Yeah. Is there like a legendary D-back that I should know about? The chance of a lifetime for Luis Gonzalez. Game seven of the World Series. Bases loaded. The next time we go to like a stadium tour, we have to wear visors. Hey look, I found Eric's glove. It's cute, huh? Honestly, I just shop in the guy section all the time. And this is why. Yeah, like I get it. Not really, I don't get it. If I'm over 50 and I'm not wearing this, I don't wanna, I don't wanna exist at that point. Should we? We're gonna see how many popcorn pieces <laughs> Is that a thing? Popcorn pieces? Yeah. How many popcorn we can catch in our mouth in one minute? Oh, wait. Four. Four. Three. Oh, no. <laughs> Six, I think. Play. Oh, okay. yeah, Safe to won. say that for the tie. Dude. Oh, that was so dirty. Did you see that? Alright. Three, two, one. I've uh, never had a tamale. I'm, I, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know what it is. Um, I feel like it's gonna be a new flavorful experience for me, though. Dude, Marika has never had a tamale before in her life, and I'm about to change her life. I'm kind of scared. Is it spicy? It's chicken. It's not red meat. <laughs> He's trying to I kill me. I was like, okay, wait. You good? You good? It's not spicy. It's probably hot though. I mean. All right, oh, yeah. all right. Thanks, you ran out of so we got a Constellation app here. How are you gonna do this? Hey, where's Eric? Appreciate it. Thank you yeah, so much. thank you guys, I appreciate it. You know what it is? It's because I'm very tall. I'm just the security in there. No, not true. She's, she's big time. I just want the caramel. I don't want the apple. Not the apple. <laughs> <laughs> Big motion. Thanks for watching. Overall rating of the D-backs, what do we got? 7 out of 10, what about you? 7 out of 10, I think for me it's like a 6 out of 10. Good atmosphere, good vibes, but the food not so much. We didn't get the churro dog. Can we get a churro dog? Um, but I don't know, stadium's super amazing, fans are awesome, so I had a good time. Um, Thanks for letting me come with you guys, I had so much fun. Yeah, go follow Marika, she's big time, she's amazing. So we had a great time, thanks for watching.